Does it ever seem like on a cold morning you can hear sounds from farther away? Well, it turns out you can. First, a little bit about sound. If you strike a bell with a mallet, that side of the bell vibrates really fast. That vibrating bell causes the air touching it to vibrate, and those vibrations are passed down the line to the surrounding air. When that vibrating air hits our eardrums, it causes the eardrum to vibrate. We call this vibration sound. Now, without air, these vibrations can't travel, so astronauts out in space have plenty of peace and quiet. Sound also travels through air at different speeds, depending on the temperature. And that brings us back to our original question. On a cold, calm morning, the air is chilliest down near the ground, with a layer of warmer air just above it. When, say, a train blasts its distinctive horn, a vibrating wave travels away from the train at the speed of sound. But here's the crucial part. The speed of sound is faster in warm air and slower in cold air. So as the sound wave gets farther away, the top of the wave, where the air is warmer, travels faster than the bottom of the wave, where the air is colder. That causes the top of the wave to bend down toward the ground. Because of this, the sound waves travel farther. This even works for voices. So next time it's cold out, keep an ear out for what you might hear.